Hey guys, it's Esli here and welcome back to the video and today we'll be reviewing episode 8 of Power Rangers Dino Charge. Basically, Sledge and his monster have created a new monster to make clones of the rangers, to basically fool the other rangers. And Tyler was their first victim. Tyler had the E-Tracer on him and he was trying to go get that gold Terrazord um, that they've been trying to look for. They mentioned that in the past few episodes. But um, there's been some fake rangers. The fake rangers were there. And then she'll be contacted me. Tyler, where are you at? And it's like, you guys are right here. It's like, no. And then the fake rangers started talking to him. Then you saw Poisandra, um, Wrench, Curio, was it? And they took the e tracer and ba bam, swiped Tyler out and he basically passed out. And at the base, the rangers were trying to look for him, like, where's Tyler? Where could he be? And they couldn't they couldn't find him at all. And Keeper came out and said, Rangers me and Kendall will look for Tyler, but you Rangers, you must defeat the double Rangers. Well, the Rangers, the original Rangers, went to a little area and they split up trying to look for the Rangers. But then Tyler woke up from his little passing out session and he's like, Dino Cycle Engage, energize. And then Tyler energized up, got in a cycle and ran out while the other Rangers were, well they found the other Rangers, the dub, double Rangers. And basically they were fighting them and the monster came and then all that stuff went down. They were fighting the Vivix and then Chase destroyed the doubles and they had to keep fighting the monster because the monster was about to make more doubles but then the rangers would have to keep fighting, keep fighting because they, they have to keep holding on. The thing is that they need the Dino Spike and the Dino Spike needs five rangers in order to do it. So they had to try to contact Tyler. Tyler however was too busy. Tyler found Fury. Fury is not going to time because Man, he wanted the E-Tracer so badly to make Sledge happy. Because Sledge is freaking mama's boy when it comes to Sledge right there. <laughs> um, so, Tyler found Fury. Tyler found Fury. And then Tyler and Fury started fighting it out. Tyler dropped this bracelet and and Fury was like, oh, I remember this. And Tyler was like, you know what happened to my dad. What happened to him? So Tyler was fighting off the Fury. And the rangers like, Tyler, we need you, we need the Nano Spike right now. And but Tyler was too busy fighting Fury. Um Tyler got some good hits. Fury got some good hits. They both got down, got back up again. Finally, Fury got down, and Tyler was about to just got him, get him, that destroy him. But then he was like, What happens we're dead? And then the Rangers call and Fury was like, Fools, and then he swiped Tyler out. He's like, the finisher. Time to finish you. And then what happened was it was crazy. There was something inside Fury trying to trying to get out, and it's like it's gold. It's like it's kind of weird. My prediction is that as Tyler's father, but we'll probably see it later in the season. But that stopped Tyler. Yeah, Fury, that stopped Fury from finishing Tyler. So Tyler went off to help the other Rangers. So the other Rangers um, were there to clean to fight the Vivix and the monster himself before he tries to make more doubles. But Tyler came. And they quickly turn their armor on, um, fight off the monster, get the Dino Spike, destroy the monster. And there you go. Poisandra, Curio, Wrench, and the other monsters were about to um, locate the, the gold energy gem and the gold monster. Um, the Zarian just about to stop them, but then Sledge went out and enlarged the monster. So they all went to the Megazord. Kendall gave him a new charger and they're like rangers used to talk to gas and dinosaurs and Kodo was like farts and yes it was farts they farted on the monsters and that's how they restored the, the monster slash slash and then they got the um the ankleo charger from last episode they used that to put that on the dino charge megazord to make the dino charge megazord ankleo tricera combination formation whatever and they used that to destroy the monster then they got back down and back down fury took the e-tracer because he wanted to make this that sledge happy because like I said here's a mama boy and Chase being the hot shot here shot Shelby's E-Tracer out of his hands and it got destroyed just before it's very was going to go to the coordinates and but still he had the, the gold charger and he'll be using that to go find the Terra sword and the episode ends with all of them in the command center saying that even though he has that gold charger, it won't be enough power to hold the Terrazord. 
but they'll still find it using teamwork thanks to Keeper with his wise word and they're like fist pump. Some good points I liked about this episode was Fury's fight with Tyler um, in Tyler's helmet. You can see a Kendall in the corner. It's kind of like Iron Man, which is pretty freaking cool. You can see Kendall's face and the Zords and the that American. It's like, like FaceTime and the Zords. It's pretty freaking cool. And I just like the teamwork aspect in this show. We'll make Down Charge, Down Charge, not Creature. So, thank you guys for watching this episode. My name is Gamer, and I'll see you guys next time for another review. Power Rangers, I know.